Now that you are familiar with using partitioning to help you to add numbers together, let's see if we can use partitioning to help us to subtract numbers. It's just a little bit different. The first step when we're subtracting numbers using partitioning is to write the equation vertically. So we're going to say 89 take away 66. Now we can do the partitioning. So we can partition 89 and say that 89 is equivalent to 80 plus 9. And 66, when we partition it, is 60 plus 6. Now we can go ahead and subtract. So we're going to subtract 60 from 80. So 80 take away 60 is 20. 9 take away 6 is 3. So we need to add 20 and 3 to get our answer. So the answer to 89 take away 66 equals 23. And that's how we use partitioning to subtract numbers.